Hi, I want to welcome you on my new series of plants to feed bees, butterflies, and hummingbirds. First off, I want to apologize for having to use my redneck teleprompter, but a lot of information here and won't be able to remember it all off the top of my head. Now, this is going to be a series of videos about the plants and not one big video and a whole bunch of them. That way you don't have to try to fast forward through a video to find a plant you want. <clears throat> this, this gives you the information on the plant itself. These plants uh, will be for beekeepers mainly. However, if the plant also covers butterflies and hummingbirds, since they kind of co-mingle, I will put that in there. The way I'm going to do this is when I make the video, it's going to be called Plants That Feed Bees. And if it covers butterflies and hummingbirds, that will be in the title, as well as the name of the plant. <clears throat> that way you can look up each plant individually once this video begins to get bigger. Or the video, the li I'm sorry, the library begins to get bigger and you can find uh, the plants you're looking for. <clears throat> I've researched about 100 plants so far. Now all native plants, so they'll have you better, give you better growing conditions. <clears throat> the information I will give you on these plants is going to be the zone, obviously, growing conditions, and, if, and if the ones I have found on, the sugar content and the nectar content. I will not be covering how to make your garden, how to plan the garden, none of that stuff. This is just going to be elaborate on the plants themselves. What makes good plants for bees in case you want to do some on your own? You may want something that's high pollen, high nectar. They also need a nectar depth less than six millimeters because their tongue can't reach no more than that. Bees also see an ultraviolet, so blue to violet tones are good plants, then yellows and whites. They don't see reds well. Also, they like sun-loving plants. Bees have to visit like two million flowers to make one pound of honey, so remember that. Alright, that's about it. I'll be making a bunch of the videos. You have to come back to check them, so remember to subscribe. If there's plants that you want information on that you think do it, put them in the comments. If I do research and they do it and they're not on my list, I will add them to the list. Thank you.